Hi guys, it's Foster here again. Uh, this time I have a little tutorial on uh, a mission in the latest simulator I got. It's the European Ship Simulator. It's a really nice game. Uh, I've seen that some of you guys have a hard time with this initial turn on this mission. And it is quite hard. Uh, but I managed to do it uh, and figure out how to do it before the uh, container ships get there. And if you if you try the mission, you know that they don't they don't stop for anything, and they actually collide with each other. If you even if you're not in the, their way, they will collide with each other, and they will definitely collide with you if you're in their way. Uh, so I've seen some other tactics like waiting waiting them out and stuff, uh, such stuff like that. Uh, it works, but uh, you need to wait for them like uh, I don't know, ten minutes, five minutes. Uh, so the trick is just to not be there when that happens. So, uh, so let's get to it. Uh, of course, the first thing you do is just go forward. Uh, I'm a, I'm a bit uh, early here on the bow thrusters, as you can see. Pretty soon, actually. Here I do the bow thrusters a bit early. You should actually wait for the bow to clear the pier before you do that. And I realized that about now. And I get but of inches of clearance, but I don't get any damage uh, report, so it should be fine. Didn't touch the dock. Now you can steer the engines full starboard, but the trick is to reverse the starboard engine. This allows you to uh, do a much tighter turn. Now you can only reverse 2400 RPMs, so if you got too much on the port side, or the outer engine, then you will make a fast but large turn, so you have to manage it at good speed here. Now you will have to reverse at some point. I haven't managed to do it in one turn, but uh, maybe if you steer port side first and then go around, maybe you can do it in one turn. Maybe I'll try that. We'll see. Here I pull down the thrust first before I start the backwards turn. Go full reverse. You should always think ahead because if you do something it takes a long time for the engines to wrap down and then go up again the other way or the other uh, if you go from reverse to forward it takes takes a while so now I think I'm backed up which I am as much as I have so you do the same turn again reverse I keep the bow thrusters on the starboard side on all the time almost it's just in the end I, I, I go uh, 
go a bit closer, I have to ease up on them. Right about here. Once you come this far, you can uh, start doing a normal turn pretty soon. Foul thrusters. Yeah, ease off the port engine because you don't want to do, do it too big of a turn. Here comes the stay on course message, which means that you have successfully got into the home marker. You can see there that the other marker is active. Now I just do a normal turn. As you can see, I will clear that container ship. There's his signal. There's my response. I think he I thought I was too close, but I'm really not. Now I just turn up the file thrusters and the normal engines. I forget to go straight here, so I, I tend to do a little too tight of a turn. Now you see these two boats, they're gonna collide. It's, it's really stupid, but they do. I think even the third small tugboat there is in, involved in the collision. But you will see it here. I am? <laughs> but they manage to keep on going. Now I realize I'm turning too much. But we'll be clear. So, yeah, that's how you do this turn with the uh, cruise liner mission and that's how you turn it on a dime and if you like this I do a lot of streaming on my twitch channel twitch.tv slash foster links down below so as always if you like this video please uh, like comment and uh, subscribe for more videos thank you see you next time